Hello and welcome back to this playthrough of Dragon Age Inquisition. <clears throat> well, I think we should talk to Iron Bowl. Meant to do it in the last episode, but accidentally hit the wrong button and ended up going to the Hissing Wastes. And I did buy uh, another book. Anything I want here? I don't really need that. No, history knowledge would be nice. So would nobility knowledge. I think I want to get this though. Let's get that. Uh, who's reporting in? Anybody? Ah, uh, here we go. that thing I think I think Colin's right. Your service. Okay. I think everybody's working, right? I think. Uh, oh. Uh, is Colin doing something? Yes. Everybody's working. Okay. Besides talking to Bo, I think we want to talk to Josephine. He likes them, truly? Very much, Lady Ambassador. It's just butter and sugar. Feraldin taste is so... simple. <laughs> yeah. Don't forget, Leliana had something she wished to speak about, Inquisitor. A pleasure. How do you stay so civil with everyone, Josephine? Bonds of circumstance among the nobility are fickle. Civility is the only constant everyone admires. And I do deplore rudeness in those who know better. Does it even become a strain, sometimes? Well, it can be trying. There is no shortage of self-regard among the nobility. The game can be wearying, discouraging, and extremely painful. But honestly, I'd miss meeting people. I've made the most fascinating friends. Better than making piles of interesting enemies. I've had both. 
sometimes depending on which way the wind has been blowing at the time. But worth it, all in all, I think. What do the people make of us? There's scarcely a noble house that hasn't openly pledged its support to us. Any visiting dignitaries I should watch out for? Van Weigart of Renden is visiting. An honor, to be sure. Please show no alarm if you hear shouting in his quarters at night. Shouting? His lordship spent a half a year with his lands under siege by Darkspawn during the Ferelden Blight. His wife informs me the band still sleeps rather poorly. Okay. Oh, there's something Liliana wanted to say. Oh. Let's go talk to Liliana. Hello. So it's true. Some look to Cassandra or even me as Justinia's successor. I never thought the idea would gain momentum. Of course, with the other candidates out of the picture. Is becoming divine something you really want? When Justinia was alive, I would have laughed at anyone who even suggested that I could be her successor. Things have changed. Still, I don't know. Restoring the Chantry will be like trying to steer a sinking vessel through a storm. No one would fault you for abandoning ship, you know. Out of the ship. And straight into the sea. You think Thedas hates mages now? If the Chantry falls, don't you think the people will blame magic? Look at all that's happened. Kirkwall's Chantry, the war, the breach. Mages are always involved. Without the Chantry to guide, that hatred will spiral out of control. Wow. You really don't think highly of the Dogians. <laughs> the people care only for simple things. Their world is small, and everything beyond it is unknown and something to fear. They will continue to live like this, unless they can be shown another way. But this is a discussion for later. If Corypheus wins, finding a new divine will be the least of our problems. Uh, we still have to, uh, I think we need to talk to her. Inquisitor, may I have a word? I notice you've paid Lady Montelier quite a number of compliments. You've found me out, Spy Master. An entanglement with our ambassador seems most unwise. I asked Josephine to join the Inquisition because we needed a diplomat, not so she could be toyed with. I enjoy being with Josephine. I'm not trying to break her heart. Then I would be more cautious. Josephine is no stranger to courtly intrigue. But love? There she's an innocent. She has no idea you are truly attracted to her. If indeed you are. What do you have against the idea of me being attracted to Josephine? I have not known you long, Inquisitor. Neither has Josephine. Her heart is easily carried away. I want to be sure it's taken by someone who truly cares. So, if you feel anything towards Josephine, I want to know. Yes. I'm very attracted to Josephine. Is that so? Whatever is between you, I ask that you treat her with kindness, for her sake, as well as yours. Yeah. 
Yes, yes. You're the stern older sister who will rip me to shreds if I so much as make poor Josephine sniffle. As long as we're both clear on that. I will not trouble you any further, but I do watch over my friends. Good day, your worship. Good day. Did want to check in with Vivian? I think she's my choice for divine. My dear, I know you must have a great deal on your mind right now, but I need to speak with you. You know as well as I how far the Inquisition's influence has spread, and how desperate the Grand Clerics have become. Our opinion will be instrumental in their election of the new divine. What do you suggest? The Inquisition may not be invited to their vote, but our actions will certainly influence the Grand Clerics. To sit on the Sunburst throne, a candidate should have grace, charm, and a will of solid steel. Cassandra may lack the first two, but unless you can think of someone better, she is the strongest choice. What would your ideal divine do with her power? The most important thing, of course, is the restoration of the Circle and the Templar Order. The institutions that have protected Sadus for ages must be rebuilt and the malcontents utterly crushed. We cannot allow anarchists to threaten the lives of the innocent. After we have restored sanity to the world, there will be time to address voices of dissent. Where can we find candidates outside of the Chantry? There must be someone other than Liliana or Cassandra. The Chantry is already desperate. They would not look to unordained women if they had any choice. You may have better luck searching the halls of the Imperial Court. There are many women serving the Empire who have the necessary presence and acumen. Actually, I think you fit the criteria perfectly, Vivian. Me? My dear Inquisitor, Thedas will never accept a mage as divine. Picture it. Your political skill and charisma, with the support of Andraste's Herald backing you. You do have a point, and I suppose there's no better way to restore order than to do it myself. If the clerics could be persuaded to consider me, and it's not impossible, I could hardly refuse now, could I? We will have to be very mindful of everything we do and say, for the Conclave certainly is doing the same. If they look to the Inquisition to provide a sign of the Maker's will, we will have to give them the right one. Yeah, I think, I think, uh, I think Vivian would be Mika's choice. What I heard. But let's go check in with Bull here. Inquisitor, come have a drink. To killing a high dragon like warriors of legend. <laughs> now I'd ask, what is that? I know, right? Put some chest on your chest. Mm. Mm. That little gurgle right before it spat fire. And that roar. What I wouldn't give to roar like that. The way the ground shook when it landed. The smell of the fires burning. Tarsidathan Halsam. You know, Kunari hold dragons sacred. Well, as much as we hold anything sacred. <laughs> Here, your turn. That thing you just said. You shouted it during the fight, too. What does it mean? Oh, Tarsadathan Halsam. Closest translation would be, I will bring myself sexual pleasure later, while thinking about this with great respect. You shouted that while it was breathing fire at us. I know, right? Ooh. <laughs> 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 
Yes, the second cup's easier. Most of the nerves in your throat are dead after the first one. <laughs> Atashi, the glorious ones. That's our word for them. Atashi. Why do you think the Kunari think of dragons that way? Well, you know how we have horns. We kind of look more dragony than most people. Maybe it's that. But a few of the Ben Hasrath have this crazy old theory. See, <clears throat> the Tamasrans control who we mate with. They breed us for jobs like you'd breed dogs or horses. What if they mixed in some dragon a long time ago? Maybe drinking the blood, maybe magic, I don't know. But something in that dragon we killed spoke to me. When you put it like that, I'm worried I killed one of your gods or something. Nah, one of Tevinta's gods, maybe. They worship dragons, right? Kill the shit out of them all you like. Dragons are the embodiment of raw power. But it's all uncontrolled. Savage. So, they need to be destroyed. Taming the wild. Order out of chaos. <laughs> Have another drink. Oh, I think we've had enough. Besides, I don't think... I think we've kind of maxed out with uh, Bull. On approval. I've had more than enough already. Your loss. All right. Okay, I, like I said, I want to go... Kill another dragon. Question is, which dragon? We've got a bunch of dragons we to pick from. Um, let's go pick, get this dragon here. Let's bring. Uh, Dorian, I guess. We're gonna go with. Two mages, I think. Vivian and Bull. Reason to go after this dragon, uh, what's it called? Kaltazan, is he's guarding an ocularum, and the last ocularum we need. So, that will unlock. The fire door, so we get 20% fire resistance, and it also unlocked the electricity door. So going after fire dragons and electricity dragons will be easier. All right. Am leveling up? I think Vivian is. Yeah, Vivian is leveling up. Vivian. Um... What do these do? Oh, I don't like that. No. 
So, I think we'll get rid of this. some arbors blessing all right we killed one dragon Monsieur. so let's see how many dragons show up one just one huh so that must be Kaltazan up there all right Oh, and we can check whether that uh, railing that got demolished is still demolished. Yeah, it's back. So it doesn't stay demolished. Anything in here? No, apparently not. the dragon nobody got terribly hurt and some of my crew got to build up their uh, their guard so that's cool all right let's see how well we can do Give you that. Vivian? Do I want to give you no this? Um Yeah, let's give you that. All right, gang. Hope you're ready for this. Oh, 
Today is a good day. Today is a very good day. <laughs> that was weird. He's waiting for his guard to go away before actually hitting them with that shit. Where are the babies? I don't know. Whoa! How are we doing on potions? Where, where we are? We're okay. Well, that didn't, that went really well. That focus ability is just amazing, isn't it? Just amazing. And we level up. Very nice. Don't need that. Only two. Let's see, fifteen, eighteen, and 
16. Well, that went really well. Of course, we don't have any focus anymore. We're going to have to get the focus back. Could use some fade touch silver, right? That'd be really nice. See. I presume you know what they will say of Corypheus, Dorian. Darkspawn, Madman, relic of an unwanted past. Don't keep me in suspense. They will say he is Tavinta. No. I'm aware you claim to be here to counter that, but the damage is done. Uh, I'm not here on behalf of my nation's reputation, Vivian. I'm here to do what is right. If only more of your countrymen felt as you do. One, two, three. Oops, where is it? It is four. Five. Oops, six. And seven. Let's go get those. Oh, and I leveled up. Well, now I want to start working down towards that. down to there. <coughs> I was also thinking about getting this for dragon fighting where I could hook on to a dragon to get in close when it starts flapping its wings because you can take damage as you're being pulled into the dragon so rather than take that damage just hook on the thing and pull myself in really quick. Uh, what, did, what did we just ping? Probably some Arbor Blessing, my guess. No. What is this? Some Dawnstone, okay. All right, let's go get these uh, shards. got going on over here? I don't know. So, uh, some red Templars, maybe? I don't know. Barber Blessing over there. Where are you? Oh, there you are. And there's another one up here. Uh, 
Let's see, we can get up here. Somehow. It has cost me some guard. Look at all this stuff. I don't want to go down in there. Or do I? There's an awful lot of it. Might as well get it. Okay, we want to go back down. Now, where's this other... St oh, there's another one right here. Somewhere. There we go. And there's another one off in this direction, I believe near a fade rift. Somewhere around here. Aha! Um, I think we want to go up like this. Because there's the fade rift. Oh, yep, there's the fade rift. Not hitting it. Where is it? Where is... There's the shard. Ah! Here we go. Everybody's leveling up again. 
We are leveling up fast. Iron Bull. I think we were working towards Horn of Valor. So let's do that. Vivian. I think we want to do some more of this. Oh, yeah. Dorian. Sounds good. I like the idea of some willpower there, so let's give him that. And we got two more shards over in that direction. So that's a shard, right? Okay. One more to go. Let's go get it. Last shard. Is, is there something to claim up here? And we are done. Anything here? Don't care about that. Nothing in here. There's some red lyrium right over there. But we're not going to crush it unless we bring Varric along. So now we have all the shards we need to go over here. finish the last two doors.
I uh, stopped by Crestwood and bought some uh, Blood Lotus. Turns out I need a ton of Blood Lotus for some upgrades to my potions. And I didn't have nearly enough Blood Lotus as I would have liked to have, so I went by there. I also bought some Spindleweed. Did a good job of killing a nug. Let's see, it's the fire door that we have to do, right? Yep. That's ours. Okay, we got them all. While I'm thinking about it, that now that we just got these resistance things, um, 
Ball, what are you wearing? Okay, you're wearing melee defense. Vivian, you're wearing cold resistance. Um, what were you wearing before that? Let's give you range defense. I don't need that. I don't need that. And Dorian, what are you wearing? Cold resistance. Um, I don't need that. Let's give you that. Oh, that's right. Vivian was wearing health. And you were wearing range defense, but it doesn't matter. Six of one, half dozen the other. It don't matter which of you guys get which. The only thing left. Stirring such a creature was worth it. It was, I think. Other people may disagree. Watch where you're stepping, Dorian. Ooh. 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 I don't care about that. Some really nice stuff in there. We get 20% uh, electrical resistance, so uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. And we got some nice loot, too. Anyway, 
that's enough for this episode. The next episode, I think we'll return to killing more dragons. Until then, have a nice day.